Okay, welcome to the AFCI Beyond Cinema Studios. We're Thank talking you. to the cast of Jamie Marks is Dead. And so I wanted to start off with how did you guys meet? Were you all already on the movie when you met? Yeah, yeah we, we were all cast we've and we been, met on been set. We've around each other. We've, we've all, we the see, we, all parties. three of us have, well, I, I, I was at a, a party one time oh, as yeah, him and I had this yeah. weird brief alter, altercation yeah. with him where his buddy's car got broken into or whatever and I Hollywood didn't think about it. is a small world. Yeah, and then I spent time, but we never had officially ever met no. any of each other until we worked together. Yeah. And um, yeah, the rest was history, I guess. So we'll start with you. What was it for you in the script that made you, that made you that made you want to do that made you want to do the movie? Uh, it was uh, well. First of all, I never read a script like this before. It was it was something completely different. It was um, uh, it has the, the, these horror elements or these these genre scary, you know, um, frightening parts. But at the same time, it was it was telling this amazing story about. Uh, uh, friendship and loneliness and, and being bullied and trying to find somebody and I don't know it just affected me in a place that I had never really experienced before and I wanted to make a movie like that and then um, how about you guys? Uh, yeah the script was was a huge thing um, yeah. uh, I, I really liked the character I thought she was she would be fun to play um, but it, it was relatable in, in the way that it felt like um, an honest movie about growing up uh, and how it can be lonely and, and depressing and like a lot of teenagers deal with that I think mm -hmm. um, and not being able to connect with people and it was interesting yeah it was again unlike things I'd read before well and I feel like Noah like some of the things that you're whispering every word when you whisper a word to him like the sorrow or the love or butterfly or anything like that I felt like that was very reflective of the high school of growing up mm -hmm. as a teenager. Those are elements that yeah. teens deal with. So I think that that makes sense that it would be a relatable character. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, definitely. Um, I mean, everybody you know has had issues in high school trying to find their spot or not feeling of not belonging anywhere or not, you know, not being able to express themselves. Um, and I think themselves. Sorry. And for me, I I just I love. I mean, I could relate. You know what through what Jamie went through and I think what interested me most was the friendship between Jamie and Adam and what he saw in Adam and how he approached Adam through the circumstances that he finds himself in. You know, he comes back as a ghost and he he's never had a friendship and it's like his first go at it and just dealing with all these different emotions and trying to connect was just really interesting to and me. And there was almost like a romance between the living and the dead. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, I, I think uh, the movie is very romantic and kind of the traditional yeah. definition of the word that, you know, it's like about... It's a dark version, but yeah. Yeah, but it, it, it's but about it, it expressing a... love or trying to find it and wanting to connect, and I think that's yeah. that's something that's um, uh, really interesting combined with the other elements of the movie. Mm -hmm. Had, did any of you read the book? Yeah. I did, yes. I did not. And what, I mean, did you read it before you shot the movie yes. then? Yeah. And you just felt like that was something that you should do? Uh, yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, uh, my 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 part is. I mean, I mean, I'm in every scene. I'm in all this stuff. I should know what what I'm basing myself off of. And I was also trying to understand the character of Adam a little bit more. I, did, I was having a little bit of trouble fi finding what uh, what motivated him, what was driving him towards Jamie, and what was what was going on with him throughout the story. I couldn't quite figure out the arc. So I wanted to see if I could find that in the source material as well. And uh, I think it did definitely help me. Uh, we, I, we sort of, uh, a lot was changed from the book and, and taken out. And even, even in the final version of the movie, it's very different from the version we shot. It, a lot of the fat has been yeah, trimmed really. to where we found the core, the emotional core of the film, which I think, um, you know, we, we credit to Carter. Yeah. Uh, so were you surprised when you saw it last night? Absolutely. Were you like, that wasn't what we thought we were doing? Well, it's different. It was. <laughs> it it was what we thought we were doing. It just was. Yeah, but it uh, you know. more con not concise, but uh, more honest or plain or simple way to say it. Yeah. Kind of, yeah. Um, without excess. And is this your first time at Sundance? Yeah. yeah. So how has that experience been? 
It's been amazing so far. It's fun. Yeah, yeah we're all staying in, in, in a big house. Huge house. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. Um, <laughs> is that how you stayed when you filmed? Because you filmed in Maine, a right? Tiny we house. filmed in <laughs> upstate New York, actually. Oh, okay. Uh, we stayed in a days in. Yeah, we stayed in a days in, the whole cast and crew together, and there was uh, nothing around for miles in this, this place, so we were kind of stuck together, snowed in most days. Just Literally, kinda, yeah. You know. <laughs> Sit, like sitting in a ta uh, at a, one of those teeny days in motel tables playing cards and staring at each other. Yeah, we played a lot of cards. <laughs> but that's what life on set is like. Is that I mean, Offset, that's yeah. off or, but There's when you when all you all don't working. film where you live, yeah. Yeah. yes, yeah. exactly. Yeah. So what you have the premiere tonight? We do. What are you excited most about when people see the movie? I want to hear if they laugh at some part. Yeah, we were. Yeah, yeah, because we, 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 yeah. we were laughing at, at stuff, and we don't know if it was because we're because we, we're laughing at you know, each other. Because, or, yeah, or, or, I think there's. I, I, I think I think the the movie has a, a surprising light, amount of uh, weird, uh, yeah, moments, some yeah. some lightness to it, which is. You know. And how was it working with Carter? Great. Great. Yeah. He yeah he was really good. First of all, even though we hadn't to relate to the question yet, we, even though we hadn't met each other before filming, like as soon as we started filming, it somehow all fit without even Carter seeing us together. Yeah, yeah. we've never knew. done a chemistry. I don't know how, but I mean, we had, we had a few days of rehearsal, would, and like yeah, you and I had clicked by the first yeah. first day. We were yeah. just you know, yeah, it worked. So that was that was really good, and he he just was really good at putting down you know what, what establishing was, the world. What was really cool about feeling, what was cool yeah. about Carter though is he gave us a lot of space. To yeah. do do what we wanted, but every us. time that we felt that we were lost or we didn't know, he was always right there to guide us right back on the on the track. You know, he gave us room, and at the same time, he uh, led it in a really um, deliberate direction. Well, and for you, how does he? I mean, you're you're pretty much dead the entire movie. Yeah, except for one scene. Yeah, yeah. yeah. when you're on the toilet. Awful scene. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I remember, yeah. Um, so, uh, what kind of your what kind of what were you trying to convey as I mean, you have probably never longing, had a role where, yeah. Longing and being completely lost, because he, you know, I mean, he's stuck. He's completely stuck in between the world of the living and the dead, and the only thing that's keeping him going is Adam, and that connection with Adam, and he just tries to find, to feel something, and to connect before he, you know, he knows, I think he knows it's doomed, but he's fighting so hard to keep holding and trying to have something that, you know, he never could have. And we, 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 you, you worked, uh, and I guess I, I did as well, a little bit on the, uh, the, the, the physical side of it too, yeah. the way that yeah. he moved. Because at the start of the movie, yeah. Jamie is, is uh, pretty mm. detached from the living world, and so his movements are a struggle, and he's, you know, he's weaker. And as the movie goes on, his character is able to move a bit more freely, and he at the same time, you know, the I'm giving him life, so I'm becoming him. weaker and kind of being torn apart myself. Well, and just to wrap up, speaking of physical a little bit, because obviously you're shirtless and not to make it weird, but um, it was it was shocking kind of because you're pretty built, and oh. it was like how that kid that kid had trouble in high school. Oh, you, I, was, I, I didn't know if that I was. That might have been the makeup. I am as skinny as <laughs> <laughs> I am as skinny maybe as maybe or the lighting or maybe. the lighting. So thanks to Darren. <laughs> but yeah, I I mean I. He tried I, to lose I, weight, I but did. he's I, just so so strong. No, I'm, I, uh, I, don't, I don't know how to <laughs> but, answer that. I just, but but you know, I don't think uh, <laughs> being picked on in high school has anything to do with how you well, look. Well, maybe maybe you know? nobody, nobody ever saw his. You know, uh, and a big, uh, I mean, Boy Scout uniform, the big mutuality on, between yeah. both boys is that they they are athletes on the track team. Um, and I'm both, not. no, you're not. No. <laughs> I'm a Boy Scout. I'm like nowhere. <laughs> but, yeah. Okay. Well, that was just something I had wondered about. Yeah. We were, I was like, did we take a shoot? Yeah. Okay. No, All right. I, I, that's interesting. It's okay. Maybe no one else will bring it up, and then it's even more weird. No, I mean, no, I, I, no it's funny though. I, I've seen, I've seen like really, bi really big guys that you wouldn't expect people to kind of bully or pick on. Kind of be, people pick them as a target because I think you know. It, it was more the emotional. It's a, yeah. It's about it's it's some people. Some people it's just. It, yeah. That's a good point. That's a good point. Well, thank you guys so much and congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Have fun with it. Have fun tonight. Thank you.